Hey guys, this is Great and Cheddar. We're here in Kashinkeri at Teriyaki Boy having lunch. Check out this video. Hello everybody, if it's your first time on my channel, my name is Great and Cheddar. Great like Great Wall of China. I'm into food, travel, and real estate. Do consider subscribing to my channel. It has been a very long day and we finished doing some stuff for a client. Now we're here at... This place called Teriyaki Boy to grab some... Uh, 15 minutes of serving time. And we're so excited to eat here. Thank you, madam. I'm here today with the boss at Cash and Carry. I haven't been here in a while. No, actually I was here like last week hunting like property for my client, but I cannot find anything. It's so disappointing. And today's special guest for food is not the senior that you know. It's not the boss. It's the other boss. What do I call you? The boss. The broker boss na lang. He's the broker boss. He's none other than the Hill senior boss there. He's there. He's getting ready for his uh, competition tonight because he's gonna win Grand Slam. Hopefully, I don't know what Grand Slam is three times in a row, but he won once last December, right? You're the grand winner, champion. Bowling. But Eng Napumasano, watch out. He's coming up soon in the Masters division. I think they have Masters for for bowling champions. Coming up soon. So it's glad to know that they serve complimentary tea here at Teriyaki Boy and. Uh, it's either hot or cold, and then the boss here, the broker boss, has approved the tea. <laughs> so guys, this branch of Teriyaki Boy has how many floors? Two floors. The, the broker boss is right. There are two floors here. You can sit outside here, or you can actually sit upstairs. You don't actually have a footprint on the ground floor, I think. I think the other footprint is Pancake House on the outside because Teriyaki Boy is part of the Pancake group of restaurants, the orange group of restaurants, from what I understand. And they have a lot of uh, brands under the Pancake House group of companies. And as usual, whenever I'm with the broker boss here, we're going to eat ramen. That is his favorite uh, food. It's his kryptonite. He can't, he can't stay away from ramen when we're in some far flung place like in Cavite, we eat ramen. When we're here in Makati Cinema Square, we're eating ramen. And then when we're here now in Kashinkar, we're eating ramen. When we're in Pasay, in near Mall of Asia, we're eating ramen pa. So ramen is his kryptonite. And we're, you know, we were looking around, you know, and he saw that there's a car shop here, you know. The, the broker boss loves his wife so much because they're gonna hunt for a new car, I think and they're comparing prices so still looking oh and by the way there is a car dealer shop right outside cash and carry just right outside with under tents beside the parking lot there's no sign but they're actually it's a car dealer second second hand car shop in case you're looking So guys, I was right. There's no ground floor seating except outside in the in the supermarket area, and you have to actually go upstairs to the second floor, right over here between Pancake House and Teriyaki Boy. So there's a second floor area here. See, you go up here, and then over here there's this Pancake House. Got that? So we're gonna go upstairs a bit. Now at the second floor, and this is where they have lots of seating. And in fact, they even have seating up here. Oh no, it's only half of it is for teriyaki boy over here, and the other side is actually for pancake house. <laughs> Hi 
Uh, and of course, the people here at Teriyaki Boy are so busy preparing everyone's orders and they're busy cooking. They have like a semi-open kitchen back Hi. here. Hello. They're saying hello. Hi. Okay. What is our kitchen? This is their kitchen. They're very busy preparing. They're preparing amazing food for us. Especially Jacker. Jacker. Who's Jacker? Chef Jacker. Chef Jacker. Is he the head chef here? No. Shoulder Jacker. <laughs> Anyway, we're so excited to try the food here. I haven't been to Teriyaki Boy in a while. The last time I was in Teriyaki Boy was there in BGC. And it's now time to try the food that they have here. Okay, we got the miso ramen without the butter. Looks really tasty and this is fun. So as you could see, we got the miso ramen, miso butter ramen, minus the butter. And as usual, the boss is so hungry. He already started. How's the soup? Okay, he loves the soup. He's loving it. He's doing the Korean heart symbol. The Korean heart symbol. See, hearts. Konnichiwa. Uh, we're gonna eat some ramen now. We're gonna taste it, and it's very delicious. They have a lot of noodles in it, and it's also mixed with a lot of vegetables, like carrots and with mushroom, carrots, corn. What's this? Cabbage. Some meat, pork. There's corn. There's even some of the toge. So let's try it right now. Here goes the test. Mm. It's okay. It needs just a bit more seasoning, but it's tasty and flavorful. Soup time. It's time to try the tasty soup. It's kind of sweet. Yeah. They put you better than it. Yeah, just to know the typical ramen isn't usually sweet. Uh, but I guess they tapered it to meet the Filipino the Filipino palate. So it's slightly sweet. It's not typically what I would like, but it's tasty in the mind. So I'm sure a lot of Filipinos will like it or people who love sweet stuff. But yeah, of course I think you can just tell them to not put the sugar also if you want. Mmm. It definitely is a wishy. And I must say, they offer fabulous service here because they refill your teacup right away. It's a good thing there are just a few people so they can easily tend to your, to your needs and cravings. So I must confess, there are some things which I say must be in a Japanese restaurant to be a good Japanese restaurant at least. If it's not for the food, they must always have complimentary tea. Diba? Either cold or hot. I mean, that's just a given already. Right? Service tea. And it has to be good tea. It can't be like the watery, like, malabnao kind of tea. It has to be very flavorful like the barley tea the roasted rice tea those are good teas or even green tea those are plus points then of course the other one is to make sure you have chopsticks because you're in a japanese restaurant right chopsticks of course it would be great if they're recyclable and stuff like this which i guess there is because usually chopsticks is made of compressed wood right and lastly, for, for to cater to the people who love spicy stuff, make sure to always have togarashi because it's the spicy chili powder that most people, well not most people, but people like me and the boss, bo boss broker, love. We love spicy kind of food. His wife also likes spicy food, right? No, <laughs> doesn't like. But the children love spicy food. Hi children of the boss broker. It's amazing when you're, when you're with a senior and the boss broker, he's setting a good example because you know the resources in this world is very limited. 
and food is very scarce and some people don't have food so it's always best to finish all the food and that's the proof look <laughs> it's simot so I'll do it I'll do it too <laughs> wait there's a hole there <laughs> I just realized <laughs> there's like holes there so if I did drink it it would fall on my clothes so it has to be it has to be sideways <laughs> I didn't notice there are holes there, it's for a chopstick, see? I'll just demonstrate. <laughs> you can you can stick your chopsticks like this. Yeah. Is it right? Chopstick like that? Confirmed by Madame over here. You can put your stop chopsticks like this, but it's a good thing I saw those holes. <laughs> my tongue felt those holes before I drank, or else it will be like spilling on my clothes, you know? That would be embarrassing, but that will make a good video. Actually, despite the ramen being sweet, I did totally enjoy the ramen. It was uh, very simple ramen, miso flavored, not as much miso as the other place. So guys, despite the miso ramen being a little bit sweet and we had the butter removed, the miso ramen was pretty decent and tasty. Would I come here again? Yes, I would come here again. Um, yeah. Add a little bit togarashi into the miso ramen and you'll totally enjoy it so much. Oh, look, it's Lukian. I also enjoy eating at Lukian. My dad, I always remember my dad at Lukian. But I now have another dad. <laughs> Broker boss, he's there. And we both approve on the ramen here. Maybe you should check it out next time, you know. Uh, and That's we'll see you. Yeah. Cash and carry. See you soon again. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, watching us eat the food and things about this restaurant branch of Teriyaki Boy. Do leave a thumbs up, a like down below, or even leave a comment. If you would like to write to the boss broker, you can write to him in my vlog also if you'd li li like to write to him. Anyway, you have a great day. <laughs>